Welcome back to our channel, the channel for the latest news and untold stories about Princess Catherine, the Princess of Wales, and her royal family. Today, we bring you breaking news. Princess of Wales dazzles effortlessly as she steps up her trend of reusing her clothing a decade ago. The royal couple of Wales, officially known as the Duke and Duchess of Cornwall, paid their debut combined official tour to the region this past week after assuming their new positions after the passing of Her Majesty. Catherine looked charm personified while she made a third appearance wearing a chestnut brown Hobbs coat that she initially unveiled in 2012. She wore the overcoat with such a red dress beneath and corresponding knee-high boots. The frugal princess reportedly reused clothing several times in recent days, including on Christmas Day, in which she donned a khaki Alexander McQueen coat that had indeed been photographed one year previously. She had also recently been going further and further backward throughout her wardrobe. In the week that, during her childhood development ad, she appeared alongside broadcaster Roman Kemp while sporting a £795 LK Bennett blazer that she originally wore a decade previously. The princess donned her well-worn, more than 10-year-old Hobbs coat during her trip to the duchy on Wednesday. The chestnut brown colour of the garment looked fantastic alongside the suede belt loop as well as corresponding sleeve details. She paired it alongside a brown Gianvito Rossi maroon kiltain sweater and coordinating skirt. The princess first wore the brown coat in 2012 when visiting Liverpool for Valentine's Day. She has since donned it six times to other public appearances. Again for Christmas Day ceremony in Bucklebury, Berkshire, in 2016, Catherine adorned the garment with a maroon fake fur throw. Catherine had already repurposed her business suit before. Just this past week, she spoke with Roman Kemp during the Shaping Us promotion while wearing a £795 LK Bennett blazer that she'd previously worn in 2011. Inside the brief seven-minute video, Catherine and Roman discuss connections, mental well-being, as well as how communities might raise a generation of happy, content people by raising kids in their early years. The princess wore their go-to blazer again for her occasion, alongside the stylish Fair Isle sweater by Holland Cooper that cost £179, together with coordinating brown Chelsea boots plus black pants. From December the 24th, 2011, Catherine made her debut in either the chocolatey brown L.K. Bennett Darwin lambskin leather overcoat while visiting a soccer game in Sandrium. She previously sported the outfit numerous times in 2012, and it had a fur collar and cuff sleeves. When she toured a daycare centre in Bedfordshire previous months, she yet again demonstrated her majesty of sustainability. The princess donned one among her favourite Massimo Dutti jackets, which she donned several times again for the tour to the Fox Cubs nursery in Luton. For the said event, Catherine wore the £349 overcoat with a red sweater and skirt set by Gabriella Hurst that cost £1,600, together with chic leather boots. The royal was dressed in sweaters by Catherine Middleton's favourite artist from York City, Gabriella Hurst. The creator is renowned for her commitment to sustainability. Her debut fashion collection for late fall 2017 has been created well with least potential negative effects on the environment. Gabriella places a strong emphasis on environmentalism in her creations, using a range of images, resources, sustainable and environmental textiles, including linen, as well as reusing yarns when possible. Princess Catherine accompanied the monarchy during the Christmas Day ceremony at St. Mary Magdalene's Chapel, looking as stylish as ever while wearing a khaki coat, a fedora hat, with a feather, plus eardrop earrings. During January 2020, the frugal princess wore the previously worn army overcoat to an event at Bradford Town Hall. The princess donned the chic orange knitted outfit for the very first time throughout a trip to Boston in December of the previous year, while she donned the overcoat when she went to the Ellie and Carew Children's Institute in Cardiff in January 2020. 
Since that day, Catherine has also donned the chic overcoat several times, notably in 2021 when she went to see the firefighters in East London. And even on Christmas Day, she pounced twice, donating a khaki overcoat that was reused to St. Mary Magdalene's Chapel at the Norfolk property. The overcoat is thought to have been created by British designer Alexander McQueen. The fashionable princess has indeed been reusing items as well as jackets, though. Princess Catherine reused a set of £79 earrings at the end of September in photos released to announce the launching of her newest Early Days program. While she announced her strategy for the Shaping Up campaign, this ambitious, lengthy effort, wherein she implores the public to join together for a better living conditions, Catherine shows the 18K Alia earrings, created by Welsh female creator Hayley Jones from her business Words of Loving. Photos posted by the princess display off the reasonably priced jewellery that she's been photographed sporting on a trip to Wales in 2020 while travelling there with Prince William. Princess Catherine is photographed sporting the £79 gold hoops designed by the Welsh woman Hayley Jones for the Understanding and Knowledge Initiative. This company is defined as creating items with a blend of trend-led modern style as well as bohemian feminine impact with either an emphasis on sustainable manufacturing. Additionally, the hoops are marketed as top sellers on the internet and delivered to clients in a 100% plastic-free and recyclable box. She wore a stunning set of £75 chalk hoops, as from the Regency assortment two days later to the BAFTA preview event of her Shaping as Initial Years program. The princess, who also joined with her hubby Prince William, looked assured in the Florence pearls that make up a component of the ageless line, according to the English firm. Prior to the Windrush Day in June 2022, the monarch donned the jewels to a number of events. She combined another white $1,337 Alexander McQueen jacket that had previously been worn in Jamaica and a 590 pound slender crepe slacks, as well as a white mulberry amberly sling purse. Numerous fashion enthusiasts have recently commented on the Princess of Wales's collection and virtually have seemed to admire her style, which appears to have become the pattern for 2023. Thank you so much for watching today's video. What are your thoughts on this fad? And do you share the same opinions with us? And for now, I bid you farewell.